This wonderful flowering plant belongs to the sunflower family. Ani means lamb in Greek and the plant has soft hairy leaves. Its origin comes from Europe, but it can now be found in many places around the world. It can be found in oils, ointments, tinctures, sprays, creams and decoctions, but it's advised not to take it raw or internally without diluting it. It's been used as a folk remedy since the early 1600s, but has never been recognised or fully accepted for its healing. It can be found in small pills in homeopathic medicine, and its use dates back centuries for treating muscle pains, aches, bruises and sprains. It has natural anti-inflammatory qualities and is used widely for reducing swellings, but can also take away the discomfort from stings and insect bites, and also from the irritation of acne. Homeopaths recommend it for burns, cuts and grazes, gout, fainting, for helping with shock, for toothache and also for nosebleeds. A massage with arnica is good for soothing chillblains and rheumatic pains, bone fractures, angina and also improves circulation and increases blood supply. It's been found to be useful for epilepsy, for hair growth and as a prevention against travel and motion sickness. Some surgeons recommend it to be used after certain operations as it speeds up recovery and it's a must-have in your repair kit if you're into sports and accidentally overdo things. It's been proven that Arnica really does take the strain from a sprain.